Still talking politics now, a 40-year-old presidential hopeful or a 40-year-old presidential hopeful is talking about the high cost of nomination forms of the All Progressives Congress, which he says may deter the youth from contesting at presidential primaries. Adimola Lawrence has more. One month from now, the All Progressive Congress will be conducting presidential primaries for all its aspirants who have showed interest in contesting for the highest political office in the country. The presidency seats. The party had released its primary election timetable ahead of the elections, while it also announced the fees for nomination firms. Presidential hopefuls are expected to pay 100 million naira, while those of governorship will pay 50 million. <laughs> for this former presidential candidate of the People's Coalition Party (PCP), who came third in 2019 election after President Muhammadu Buhari and Atiku Abubakar. The nomination form is a way to scare youth away from contesting the election. But he said the Nigerian youth must brave up to their responsibility if indeed they want to make a change. Speaking with journalists, the presidential hopeful said Nigeria needs a vibrant youth who will bring in fresh ideas into government of the country. Let us be the generation that we end insecurity and poverty in Nigeria. Let's be the generation that we ensure that every single Nigeria who is willing to work, get the desired training and opportunity that will lead to a sustainable livelihood. Nigeria must be able to earn a living wage that can pay the bills and provide subsidized and quality education to our children. He added that for Nigeria to compete favorably among the League of Nations, then it must take serious the welfare of our citizens. Rescuing Nigeria and Nigerians from Penera East security by strengthening and equipping of our military formation and the police force. More men and better equipment are desperately needed. Number two, improving power generation by revisiting and correcting loopholes in the privatization process and also delving into alternative energy sources. Providing quality and affordable health care for the people. For many here, Nigeria needs someone who has the political will to diversify the nation's economy and must be ready to turn things around for the growth and development of the country. Adimola Lawrence, TVC News, Lagos.